The World Health Organization has warned that the lives of over 1 million displaced people in Gaza could be in danger as several diseases are reportedly spreading in the area. The growing threats of circulation, of course, of the circulating diseases are being attributed to overcrowding families, lack of clean water, and other related factors. Now, amid the impact of the conflict, infections have been increasing in the affected areas, and access to medication remains a challenge. Here is more details of that in this report. The World Health Organization is warning of the risk of the spread of infectious diseases in Gaza, threatening the lives of some 1.5 million displaced people. The UN reports that an increasing number of people have been infected with various diseases, such as respiratory infections, diarrhea, dermatitis, and other diseases related to lack of safe water and hygiene facilities. As you can see, the waste is everywhere. We even suffer from the lack of food and clothes for our children this winter. All of us here in the Gaza Strip suffer because of these difficult conditions which lead to the spread of disease in epidemics and crowding of clinics with patients. Several factors have contributed to this growing threat of disease, including severe overcrowding of families inside shelters, a lack of running water, failures in the sewage system, and the accumulation of solid waste. All in addition to an extreme shortage of medicines and personal sanitary supplies. Drinking water is expensive and not available. Everything here has become expensive and we cannot find the minimum level of cleanliness. Here we are in the school, very crowded like a flock. Yesterday there was heavy rain that drowned our tents and our belongings. The water collected here, as you can see, because there are no longer sewage lines working. And this is the cause of diseases. Officials in Gaza say some 350,000 cases of infectious diseases have been reported in recent weeks. The spokesperson for the Al-Aqsa Martyrs Hospital says the spike in the infections is compounding the facility's overcrowding issue, impacting children especially. Due to the increase in the number of displaced people and the lack of safe drinking water, Epidemics and diseases such as intestinal infections and vision infections are spreading among them. The pediatric wards in the hospital were completely filled due to the spread of diseases and the infection of many children with diseases, which forced us to place two or three of them in one bed. The onset of the rainy season and the possibility of floods have increased fears of overburdening the sewage network in the besieged strip. The absence of fuel has already led to the closure of desalination plants, increasing the risk of water pollution and diseases outbreaks.